Welcome to the Alberta Healthcare Aid Directory Training for Applicants. This is one of two short videos showing you how to complete the application process. The first step to create an account is the subject of this video. If you're not sure whether you should apply or have questions about eligibility, take a few minutes to review our website. There, you'll find information about the benefits of being included on the directory as well as a section on frequently asked questions. Creating an account only takes a few minutes. You'll need a valid email address and a computer, tablet, or smartphone connected to the internet. To navigate to the sign up page, open your web browser and enter the address shown here, or if you are invited to sign up with an email, look for the link in that message. You can also find the link on the HCA website. Once you get to the sign-up page, you're prompted to enter an email address. Be sure the email address is valid and that you have access to its inbox. Once ready, click the Next button. If your email address was previously registered on the site, you'll be prompted to log in. Otherwise, you'll see this form. Enter your name and the code that appears. The code is used to confirm you're a real person signing up and not a web bot. Before you can move on, you need to accept the terms of service. Please review those first. Your email address is used only for the purpose of communicating with you about your HCA application and status. When you're ready, click the sign up button. You'll be notified by email to confirm the address you signed up with. Go to your inbox and find the verification message from albertahcadirectory.com. The email may take up to 10 minutes to arrive. If you can't find it, be sure to refresh your inbox and don't forget to check your spam or junk mail folder as well. Once you've found the email, click on the verification link and you'll be directed to a form where you complete your profile and establish a password to secure your account. If you want, you can add a mobile phone number to your profile to make it easier for directory staff to contact you. There is also an option to enable notifications on your phone. This allows us to send you a text message advising you when there is new information to review about your application. Personal information is not included in notifications. Your password must be at least eight characters long and contain at least one punctuation or special character. Once you complete your profile, use your new account to log in and submit an application. Watch the next video for an overview of completing the application form. Thanks for watching.